Hey, everybody, Scorpion here. So we are gonna do this uh, this shop update, all right? Um, so it is 11-19-2023, uh, about one, almost 1.15 1 a.m. East Coast time, this fine, cold Sunday morning. Uh, we're, we're in the mid-30s outside right now. Not too bad, but a little chilly. Um, so we're just gonna kind of walk you through and let you see what we got going on in the shop from last week to this week, uh, what's changed and uh, stuff like that. So we hope y'all enjoy. So I just did the precious metals video for the Silver Scorpion channel and the National Scrap Price Watch for the Scrap and Scorpion channel. Uh, so if you like either one of those, it's linked on the main page. Feel free. Um, this I've got a box up maybe this week, maybe just before I leave to go to Vegas, something like that. This computer's still giving us a fit, but we do have some new parts in to put in it, and if that doesn't solve it, we're going to end up rebuilding the whole thing. Probably swap the motherboard and the, P and the processor that are in there uh, for something bigger and better. I'm not sure where I'm going to come up with the money for that, but as it sits, it's more of a pain than anything and is slowing me down. Um, here's a computer we have that might be worth salvaging. We'll have to swap hard drives out in it, and uh, or at least wipe the hard drive and see what we could do with that. This is now up and running. It has been running for about four days straight. Uh, just making sure it's gonna run like it's supposed to. And uh, so far, so good. It hasn't overheated or anything. So uh, it seems to be doing pretty good. We've got it connected to the internet. Uh, we've got most of the stuff in for it uh, to put it together. We still have one slot card that needs to be purchased that was like seven, eight hundred dollars. That's to get all the HDMI's into the computer to be able to show uh, video from here. Um, and once we get that up and running, there'll be other stuff coming out as well. Um, our technician, computer technician, did go pick us up a server today. So it's not here so I can show it to y'all, maybe next week. Um, I, it'll be sitting here hopefully so we'll be getting that put in and that kind of thing no we're not running the volume right now to need a server but we found one for a good price that should handle what we need so if stuff starts getting crazy or something we're already there and, and we've got it taken care of hadn't been any 3d prints this week or the last couple weeks um, with the weather fluctuating like it is, it's a little difficult to do this 3D prints and all. Because you gotta kinda hold a steady temperature or it changes how it sets up molds each line if the temperature's changing on it as it's building. So hopefully we will be getting back to that here before too long. We do have, there's a bunch of other parts for cameras and computer and the computer that will be installed. Um, with that said, we do have heating and air company coming in in the morning. They are supposed to be putting a brand new heat pump in. So hopefully that'll help. Um, we will be using other heaters along with it because heat costs money. Um, but if we can keep it semi warm off of some cheaper heaters than running that HVAC all the time, that'll help keep our electric bill down some. Um, so this build was complete this week. So it's put in so we can run the laser, suck all the nasty stuff out and into the system and blow it out the door there. And we don't have to sit in here and breathe it or worry about it getting inside of the computers and, and all that stuff. We do have the table set up. So we are sitting on mainly a wood burning laser. It can also 3D print and CNC. I've never really tried the CNC on it. Um, two lasers for metal and two computers, one to run each. 
and the man behind it all over there having a blast. Got the heat press going, people are making uh, stuff over there. Looks like a bag or something, I'm not sure. We did pick up a safe this week. Um, so hopefully next couple weeks we'll get it set up and all so it'll store, you know, the, the gold, the silver, stuff like that that's high dollar that we don't want left sitting out where somebody could walk through and pick it up or, or take it. Um, dogs are doing their thing over there, having a blast like always. Somebody's sitting over here all prim and proper, aren't you? <laughs> Uh, shop. Let's see what we got going on out the here. Off and the rest is going to go as breakage. So we got that's right. Oh, look, he's doing an update caught too. Him, caught I'll him in back. the middle of a video. Uh, our power supply is sitting out here. We do hope to get a silver cell up and running before long. Still a few things we need to purchase to get that going. Uh, when we tried to melt a gold bar for the guy, we blew this one up. So I'm going to have to buy a new electric furnace. Yay. Uh, let's see. Mm, so, on the scrapping channel, I weighed this and I also weighed the boards. Uh, so, I think one of the videos is out. The other one I think is coming out tonight. So, that's on that 90 computers that we picked up. As you can tell, they're all gone. Um, so, we still have to go through slot cards. Um, all the heat sinks, all the power supplies, all the boards, all the wire, DVD drives. Yeah, there's some I haven't finished yet. And all the chips to see what our final will be um, in, in the 90 that we picked up. Um, we bought them and picked them all up for two dollars and fifty cent a piece uh they seem to be all of them had what two to four sticks of ram in them uh, most of them had four sticks of ram in them i was i was pretty impressed That's so yeah we've got a whole box of ram so that that goes to it too we got to add that up um quite a few slot cards um that kind of thing so there'll be more videos on that totaling that up and uh, getting that information out there uh each step of the way, what each thing is worth, uh, what its value is, that's boards from it too, and that tote, and uh, that kind of thing. And I think that's the main thing we worked on this week, isn't it? Yeah. We still got a bunch of screens we gotta go through, a bunch of other stuff. Um, we did run two runs of shred. I think I listed one as a short, maybe. I don't even know at this point. I'm so confused. Um, <laughs> Yeah, he's got a video out two days ago, so check out That's Right Recycling. Make sure you uh, find find his video. I know one of them I did a video on. I think that was the big load I did the video on. No. No, it was a smaller load. It was the computers. So we ran just the shred from the computers. Uh, and I've been keeping up with the prices on, on all that. So we definitely want to know what type of profit we're making. And I even figured the gas into the uh, pickup on it so jotting it all down on paper going step by step line by line just to kind of give y'all some idea uh hours to take it apart will not be in in the uh in the projection there um <laughs> we haven't been alone in hours we're making nothing. yeah yeah i mean we we did the diesel but uh we we didn't keep up with um with our hours or time in it um and and that's somewhat important uh if you're running a business but at the same time where we're headed it's probably not gonna make that much of a difference to us once we get to that point we just have to get to that point um but yeah so we've got two totes of boards we've got two totes of power supplies we've got a thing of a total wire a tote of uh, DVD drives. We did get quite a few of these um, three and a half inch floppies. I'm sure some of y'all have no idea what that is. Uh, it's kind of old school. That was that was the running thing when I was a kid on computers. That was the best of the best. 
Um, so yeah, and those those DVD drives right there, they should have gone with the shred, but we forgot. So numbers will be off a little bit, but we'll have a pretty good idea of, of what we got and what we got going. Uh, I've got this many motors so far from fans out of it. I've got those left to do along with the heat sinks that have to go with these and all that. So uh, basically, I think that's pretty much it. We were pretty busy this week. Um, videos will probably slow up because I am going, I'm at work. I'm working uh, 10 days straight, 10 hours a day. So that's 110 hours in 10 days on the clock. And uh, then I'm off one day and then I have to uh, leave late that night to drive down to the airport and uh, catch a flight. So bear with us. Uh, stuff will be jumping around. I'm sure Jericho will probably throw something up in the short here or there, but I guess that's about it. Am I missing anything you think of? No. Yeah, that's about it. So, hope everybody's doing good, and we'll catch you next time.